Hey yo, what's up everybody? Holmes here and we're back with some more Neo 2 boss guys. Today we're gonna be taking on the second DLC of Neo 2, Darkness in the Capital. And this is gonna be the first boss you're gonna encounter. And she's really fast and she can power through your combos. So she always starts off the fight with a summon to either the Kasha or she'll summon the Mitsu uh oh, shit, I forgot. The horse of the cow demon. And you can burst counter it to um, deal with some stamina damage or some chip damage. Uh, this Phoenix move you can dodge her side. Uh, she has pretty much just your standard, I guess, longsword, two handed longsword attacks. Like grab, you can just back up to avoid that. This move, watch out, you want to stay away because of that little slicey thing. If he chases you, just walk away. I mean, run away. Uh, that attack can dodge it by stepping backwards. The grab, step backwards, get a few combo, like not long combos, like I guess you spam your square button in low stance I'm hoping you guys are playing in. If you're playing on any other stances, I guess, you know, try just doing regular attack as well. Don't, don't mix in long combos, like I said, she'll power through your attacks and probably kick your ass pretty hard. Um, let's see what she got, another summon, we counter burst, deal some stamina damage and HP damage when she go into the human realm like when she gets out of the dark realm just kind of like dodge around her the combos are still the same except there is um, now lingering like fire which will diminish once uh, her stamina breaks uh, which will be pretty soon because she will attack you relentlessly so once her stamina breaks uh, the special like fire attack will disappear and the fight actually ends at around uh, 20 to 25 percent this one right here sometimes she'll do this to start off the fight just saying so a little heads up there um, but yeah once her HP drops to around 20 or 25 percent she a cutscene will play and the fight will end there it's kind of like uh, Williams fight from the base game and yeah, so once you see the cutscene, the fight's over, and you just got through your very first boss of the DLC. So yeah, um, the most dangerous part about her, like during the fight, it's when she goes back into the human realm, and then she goes uh, on that crazy fire buff thing and here is my level and my stats if you guys are wondering what level I am and yeah that's pretty much it I'm just gonna grab the stuff and we are gonna wrap up this boss guide so thank you all so very much for watching hopefully this video has been entertaining or helpful or enjoyable and if you all found at least one of those qualities in this video then hey stay tuned for more but until next time I hope to catch y'all later Holmes out